Jeez, that's a big branch. This is from the windstorm. Imp it like impaled the ground. <laughs> My nice new red top. I think a nice like new it. red top is nice. <laughs> we go anywhere on the property, bring back an item. That's and, right. And then he tells us which is our favorite. I tell you which is good and, and which is not. Was. And where I was, baby. And if we can get rid of it, and that has not happened yet. <laughs> not once. <laughs> I'm going to try to go someplace we haven't been yet. I'm Me glad. too. I'm, I'm glad to hear that, Frankie. I'm glad to hear that you're going to try new things in life. Don't get too concerned. The yard is in a state of Armageddon. We, Lousy smart weather. It's like a tail of a hurricane. Took our power <laughs> and messed up our trees. And now Mansur and Matt needs to come out here and get this place. Yeah, he's going to be hired to next week. So yeah, I don't think anybody's come this way yet. This looks dangerous and interesting. There's always a temptation to go for kind of the, the WTF choice. Like, let's bring him a wheelbarrow. How funny <laughs> would that be? But we are supposed to be competing for, for a favorite item. You know what, in that case, I, th I think the cozy coop is the way to go. The car? Yeah. What's your reason for getting that one? For as long as I've known John for a decade, this thing's been out here just stuck in the grass somewhere. He's got his own personal manservant and he <laughs> can't get this thing cleaned up. I actually used to have one of these. Everybody, they're called cozy coop. And I guess I gotta carry it so he doesn't hear the wheels rolling. Close your eyes, please. Keep them closed. We're closed. All right, Frankie has put down an item, maybe. Yep. <laughs> It does feel a little overwhelming. I have a giant bee's nest. Do you think there are still bees in it? Are you allergic? No. It's something bad. <laughs> I'm bring in this bucket, okay? I don't think it originated here. I think it was collected and brought here. Close your eyes! I feel like a little red riding hood. <laughs> like a thick, twisted, like Tim Burton version. Oh man, it's really big. There's always so much stuff on the table. I adore. <laughs> Jump horse. Let's go with this. Fun for the whole family. Need to randomly select an item. Jump horse! An exciting game for the whole family. So uh, this is jump horse. I got that. <laughs> so far so good. I see that there was a dollar price tag on the corner at one point. Yes, and then it was then downgraded to 75 cents. <laughs> I don't actually know a whole lot about this item. By that you mean nothing. I thought this item was thrown away already. <laughs> if time was a, was a continuum <laughs> that you could just inspect at any point, I knew it was here. Jump horse if, here. Do you have any idea where it came from? <laughs> <laughs> I wonder if it, it came from outside somewhere. The barn or maybe the back far shed? I mean, when uh, things no. get thrown out around here, they don't make it very far. <laughs> they just go into the woods deeper. I'm going to have to guess it was in the barn. I'm going to go with the barn. Not. Not. I know that it was purchased, I think, by my sister when she was younger because it was horse-based. And Michaela, I think it was Michaela who got it, and she was really into horses. This sounds so made up. <laughs> no, no, it's true. Uh, there, was a, there was definitely a sister, and she... <laughs> uh, and there was a uh, purchase. Girls like horses. It was from a yard sale. It's from 94, copyright date. When it was in the house and still not something I had mentally thrown away. I try to get people to play these weird board games. No one would ever want to deal with it. Do you have any VHS-based board games? Because I would like to play no, one. Like no. Nightmare? Yes. <laughs> so, you want to play the game? So I like the manufacturer's Equiplay, which Equiplay. sounds very PC. Equine is horse, so it's ah. horse-based. Where was this item on the property? Uh, lower Room of Disaster. Lower. The lower Room of Disaster. Fascinating. The dumpster um, room, apparently. Yeah. Jump Horse, I would love to play it. If anyone wants to play a game of Jump Horse after this, I would, I so, would totally So even though you it. thought it was thrown away, you're not going to throw it away now? <laughs> Guilty look. <laughs> Nicely colored board. There's a cash system as well. Ooh. Various tokens. Some jump horse bucks. It's like a combination of Monopoly and 3,500 other games. There's even the instructions. Let's play jump horse. <laughs> <laughs> I can't even close this item up. I'm still having trouble here. You better just throw it out. <laughs> <laughs> what do we got? Oh. Ah! You can place that gently on the ground, Nina. This is a wasp's nest, <laughs> thankfully. <laughs> I know exactly where it was. In the barn, near the back, right in front of the back door, straight in on the floor. This is not my item, this is my father's item. And he said he saved it to give to my sister so she could show her students. It's to kill the bigger wasps, Jay. It's theoretically interesting, right? I mean, I guess, but 
Uh, <laughs> six to eight months, probably, it's been sitting in there. So a lot of time built up to uh, for this big reveal in class. <laughs> yeah, I know it's dead, but it still kind of freaks me out because I'm so, like, averse to wasps. Item number three. Wow, what an item. It was outside, not in contained in any structure. This was my original Cozy Coop when I was a kid. A lot of fun times had in this, me sitting in there playing with a little steering wheel. When did you lose a tire? We did a big cleaning. This one survived the purge because... I thought that, you know, if a kid ever did come to play, they might find it amusing. I mean, I can see what happened. It roughed it out pretty badly, and then the tire just There's fell a sticker off. on the back. This yeah. one I actually put here, and it stood up incredibly well uh, considering. Uh, it says seatbelt use required in this vehicle. <laughs> um, this was part of a, a set. Did there was a gas it? pump. I had the little gas pump, not and for the Cozy Cooper, for yeah. another one. You had a little thing, and you had a crank on the gas thing, and you could you could fill it up, and you it was... You play um, like you're putting in gas, Yeah, you're not actually putting anything in? Exactly. I specifically <laughs> remember keeping a couple of my stuffed animals who I'd oh, go out with them. I'm a little actually sad that its wheel is broken, which kind of means that it's not really fulfill its purpose anymore as an emergency backup child's toy. Gloria is not so going to have any fun with this thing. Is this the first thing to get thrown out? <laughs> it's even got a super cute door. You don't have to crawl in. Look, you can open it. It's a got a of, lot of bugs. A lot of bugs. But I mean, it hasn't been outside for, for 15 years. Doesn't it remind you of McDonald's? It does. Yeah. What a shame. It, the wheel just rotted right off. Okay, so I think that the jump horse came from Zach. The cozy coop came from Nina. And I think that the... the, the the B stuff came from Frankie. Am I right on zero out of three? Zach. Just that. I should know. Nina goes in for those <laughs> weird <laughs> items. Yeah. That's my third victory. Uh, I got elephant. I got his picture with the cow. And now this. You just got to go for the nostalgia factor. I'm pretty tempted to throw it away. But you're not actually going to do it because that takes effort. I could have you throw it away for me. <laughs> <laughs> what do I look like, man? Servant Matt? Yeah, you don't. So that's today's scavenger, John Frankie. You have won with Thank the Cozy Coop. Thank you.